So yeah, I guess we're going to be trying out the Artificer again, so... This is our current setup. We've got three Shatters, one Bag, one Head Injury, one Lemonade, one Plant, and one Dynamite. And I... And uh, yeah, we're uh, not running with the music anymore. Hmm. Oh yeah, so, and if you aren't uh, familiar with the Artificer, it ha gives plus 175% explosion damage, plus four explosion sides for every one elemental damage you have, Minus 100 damage, and armor modifications are reduced by 50%, so that's gonna be fun to deal with. Also, this is take two of recording this video because I kind of forgot to try to see if uh, OBS was recording when I first started, so yeah. Speaking of which, let's try to see if OBS is recording, and it is, so that's nice. Alright, that's wave 4 completed, and we did a claw three, so let's just recycle that one. Take the luck, and I guess the range damage, which, uh, yeah, I guess the minus 100% damage doesn't affect the shredders in any way, shape, or form, so that's good. And let's take the medical turret, and the recycling machine, and the reroll, save the sacred, oh, bleh, scared sausage, not sacred, I don't know why I got sacred sausage out of scared sausage, so yeah, I guess it just stands to forgive me for that one. And just re-roll, save the Shredder, and move on to 5 And I think this build is gonna benefit a lot from the Scared Sausage. See, I said it right the first, well, that time, anyways. So yeah, Ultra to 5 And it's business as usual. Now with the medical turret. So that's good. Hopefully I can find some more of those. Alright, so that's Wave 5 completed, and it's the lens. Let's just take that one without question. And you know what, let's take some more luck. And take the Scared Sausage, the Shredder, the Dynamite, which uh, also helps uh, with the explosion damage. And just adds plus 15%, so that's good. And let's just re-roll. Save the Hunting Trophy, take the Glasses, and now I'm broke on 26. And I'm surprised I found the Hunting Trophy uh, this early, but I guess that's one of the benefits of playing on Danger Zero, since uh, I think uh, rare items are more common than on uh, Danger Zero than on Danger Fives or something like that. Hmm. And yep, uh, I guess the Scared Sausage is uh, working out uh, quite well so far. I think I need some more elemental damage, which directly translates into more explosion sites for me, which is a good thing for crowd control. And I need to stop taking in unnecessary damage like that, so yeah, but at least we healed up uh, pretty quickly, so, so that's good. And I think I need some more speed, because speed is keen, as I keep saying, and take a drink of water every time you hear me say that. Ow. Oh well. At least he, um, uh, the ride this wave the light so. And let's just try to find recording, yes I am, so let's just take some more luck. And the hunting trophy, the, say the card grade, for later, and re-roll. Take the weird food. And I'm broke on 27. And yeah. I think I need more elemental damage. Oh well, I can find that later on in the run. Welcome to 27. And the nice thing about Danger Zero is we don't have to deal with any uh, elite or horde uh, malarkey, which is nice. And yeah, I think I need to uh, start increasing my crit chance. And that's wave 7 completed, and let's see some more life steal. Actually, you know what? Let's take the crit chance. And the shredder to the target grade, and re roll. And I think we're gonna save the shady potion and the landmines for later, because they're not going for any particular build this time around, so yeah. And you know what? Let's save the alien eyes too, and move on to wave 8. I'm just about to take out the, uh, whatever that was. So, yeah. Hmm, I think I need more crit chance. If only so we can have, uh, more materials for that hunting trophy. And I think I might need to turn down that sound. Cause that's, uh, kinda loud. So, let's just, uh, crank it down to, like, so. Now I can hear myself think. Which is nice. Ow. Oh well. At least I, uh, hit the shield. So, yeah. I think I might need to get some more dodge. Oh well. And that's wave 8 completed, and uh, 
Let's restart with the butterfly because of that minus one elemental damage. So yeah. Let's take the elemental damage and take the attack speed because why not? And let's take the shady potion, the alien eyes, the landmines, and a re and a reroll. Save the medical turret. And just click that button again and take the bad. For more materials whenever you pick up the crate, so that's always a good thing. And now I'm broad, save the landmines for later. And it's on to the Speedy Boys wave. Which is wave 9. Ow, I just, just wasted that shield pretty quickly. I need to stop doing that. And that's wave 9 completed, and it's in acids, so let's just recycle that one, take the Lumberjack shirt. And I guess the elemental damage. And the medical turret, the landmines, the tree. And normally I'd say the small magazine, but I don't think I won it this time around because of that minus its damage debuff. But let's take the second hunting trophy. We've had one hunting trophy, yes, but how about a second hunting trophy? And let's take the shredder. And hmm, take the scope. And I guess the piggy bank and move on to a 10. Order to a 10, or it's business as usual. Ow, and I think I just wasted my shield. Oh well, I think I need some more target raid. Right? And I think the uh, sound is way too loud. So let's just uh, put it down uh, to there, and let me know what you think of that in the comments below. So yeah. But hey, at least you should be surviving this uh, wave like so. So that's what you pinned done and over with, so let's see some more uh, attack speed. And some more damage. And the Shredder 3. So let's just combine two Shredders. And take the Shredder 3. And re-roll. Take the Shredder 2. Like so. And hmm. Let's save the eye surgery later, because burning activates 10% faster, so I think that might be a good thing for us. Hmm, nothing here, and now I'm broke, on to wave 11, and I really should be saving more materials, uh, just for the pity me. And yeah, more damage is always a good thing, so I think we might need to find some glass cannons or something in the, in the shop. Oh boy, that's gonna be fun to do. And I guess, uh, that's wave 11 survived. And it's a banner, so let's take the banner for our attack speed. And let's just name it Bruce, because why not? Let's take the crit chance. Actually, you know what? Let's take the speed. Because again, speed is king. And let's take the coupon, because, uh, coupons are also king. And take the eye surgery. Hmm, take the Cyclops worm, save. And take the sunglasses for more crit chance. And now I'm broke on to a 12. And we now have a uh, minus 70% damage instead of the 100% damage debuff uh, that we started out with, so we're making progress on that. Which is a good thing. Welcome to a 12. And I guess uh, that speedy boy got uh, immediately deleted upon spawning. So yeah. And that's what you call the done and over with, so let's take some more harvesting. And the head injury. And a re-roll. Ooh, look at your launcher. Let's just save that one for later, move on to a 13. And yeah, I think I'm going to toss the Shredder uh, Tier 1 for a nuclear launcher 3, which is going to be fun to play around with, especially on the Artificer. Which, uh, helps with the explosion damage, which is gonna be fun! And that should carry us through the rest of this run. As one single nuclear launcher. And that's wave 13 completed! And let's recycle the boxing glove, and recycle the terrified onion. And let's just take the nuclear launcher 3 without question. So, goodbye, Shredder uh, Tier 1. And let's just re-roll. You know, let's take the gentle alien because I think we can handle that. And another re-roll. And let's just move on to A14 and hopefully save up uh, 3K for the entrepreneur. So that's gonna be fun. But yeah, welcome to A14. And yeah, that thing got deleted immediately. 
I think that empty launcher is going to be our big, uh, delete button. So, that's nice. And that's wave 14 completed. Let's take the lemonade. And some more elemental damage. And let's see, take the shredder 4. And move on. To wave 15. And yep, uh, everything in their path has been deleted. Which is a good thing for us anyways. And that's wave 15 completed. Let's take this other scared sausage. And let's take some more life steal. Actually, you know what? Let's take the attack speed just for the nuke. And I don't think I want anything here. Not even that banner, which is named Bruce. And let's take the dangerous bunny. Take the dynamite. Hmm, nothing here. Take the snake. And move on to a 16. And yeah. Yep, everything has been deleted, and that's the good thing for us. And that's why 16 completed, and we got uh, one. We're halfway to our 3k mark. Uh, well, goal. So let's just restart the metal. Take the vigilante ring without question. And take some more damage. And take the plastic explosive. For more explosion size. And we roll. Take the Sunting Trophy without question, because that's more materials for us. Along with this uh, potato. Because it's a game named Rotato. Why not want it have potatoes in it? And let's just move on to A17. And just delete whatever that was. Immediately. Hmm. I guess that's one of the uh, main benefits to nuclear launchers. And I think I'm gonna bring down that uh, sound, because that's a bit too loud still. And yeah, I think that might be better. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And that's A17 completed, and it's a gentle alien, so let's take that. And, hmm... You know what, let's take the jetpack. And the attack speed, which is not 48. And the fuel tank, which uh, helps with the uh, explosion size, so that's now up to 44%, which is nice. Let's just take the lucky coin. And the coupon. You know I uh, did that backwards. On to 18. Hopefully I can make uh, 3k beat uh, during the net this wave and next wave. Hmm. I think I might have to skip spending uh, materials at uh, that shop and just uh, move on if I want to unlock the entrepreneur. And that's wave 18 completed, and it's a propeller hat. Let's just attack with that one. Hmm. Let's save the ricochet for later. And I think the, uh, that's a skeleton for later too. On to wave 19. Without spending any money. And now we're at 2.5k. So we just need to come up, rustle up about uh, 500 materials uh, for the 3k challenge uh, to be completed. And that's a 3,000 uh, mark of mat, so I can now spend all of my money and on the next shop, so that's nice. And yeah, that's the entrepreneur in lot. Ow. Assuming I uh, managed to survive this way, which I did, and it's a coupon, which is uh, kind of funny. So let's just take the coupon, take the range damage, and the ricochet, the exoskeleton. Nothing here. Mm, take the landmines and the cosmic sludge. Nothing here. Take the landmines and the eye surgery. And this other nuclear launcher. Which is gonna be fun for the mobs to deal with. And take the incendiary turret. And take the improved tools. Take the glasses. And it's lemonade. Nothing here. Take the blindfold. And the Cyclops worm. And the weird food. And this med kit. 
And now I'm Bro drawn to a funny, which is a boss. So I think it's gonna be rather fun to see how the uh, nuclear launchers delete the boss. And, uh, yep. And I think everything else on the map is dying pretty quickly. Thanks to the ricochets. Because uh, those are kind of uh, overpowered if you can get your hands on them. Because they just let you just stand in place and just delete everything on the map. Assuming you don't end up dying, that is. So, yeah. I made it this far. I don't want to die uh, this uh, far into this run. So that's uh, that way dealt with. Well, phase, I should say. And it's, it's on to this phase and this far, so... Hopefully I should be able to uh, deal with everything. Since the retrochades are doing their job and just deleting everything. Ow. And that's the run one. It's funny how I can uh, win runs on uh, Danger Zero more often than I can on Danger 5, but oh well. And let's see, we've unlocked the Entrepreneur and the Explosive Shells, which is gives you plus 60% explosion damage and minus 15% damage. And you can get as many of them as you can find, so that's uh, fun to play around with, especially as the Artificer. And the Entrepreneur uh, has a minus 25% item price, uh, uh, power modifications are increased by 50%, gain 25% more materials from recycling items, and minus 100% of your materials at, at the start of the wave, so you just lose them all, so that makes uh, no sense for me. And damage modifications are reduced by 50%. So yeah, anyways, uh, like the video if you liked it, subscribe if you want to see more of this uh, kind of content from me. And if you want to support the channel, uh, there's a link to my GoFi where you can uh, buy me a copy, which is always appreciated, along with some uh, Amazon affiliate links to my setup that I actually use. Anyways, I guess I'll see you in the next one tomorrow, so stay tuned for that one. Bye!